guys welcome back to my channel um my name's danielle i'm a mum to a three-year-old and an 11 week old baby and i'm currently on a weight loss journey following the slimming world plan um thank you for clicking on on this video whether you are a returning subscriber or new to this channel if you haven't already i'd love it if you could subscribe to the channel um click like if you enjoy this video and pop me a comment and say hello how are you doing um if you're following someone well planned or you just want to say hey so um today's video is a what i eat in a day and also a weigh-in update for week five so i'll do the weigh-in update at the end of the video so let's get into the what i eat in a day so we are going to be having the red velvet protein world pancakes this morning and i just wanted to show you how quick and easy oh move my phone out the way uh how quick and easy these are to make so i'm gonna have four scoops so i've just added 80 milliliters of skimmed milk and this is what the mixture is looking like it smells amazing and this is them cooking right now. So this is the final result. Look how delicious that looks. Now this is about 10 cents, which may seem a lot, but it just looks so indulgent, doesn't it? And this isn't the first time I've tried this because I had it for my breakfast last weekend because it's just a bit of a treat, isn't it? You're not gonna have it every day. But for 10 sins, I think it's definitely worth it. And let's cut into I don't want to cut into it. It just looks so pretty. Look at that. It's just like cake. Let me try it. It's just delicious. It really is. Now, these were gifted, but... Um, they're not sponsored, I'm not paid to give my review or anything like that, so it is my honest review. So I, I highly recommend these. Um, if you are interested in any of the protein products, um, I'll pop a link to their website below, and there is a 40% off code, um, which is PWDANI, D-A-N-I. Pop it on the screen, and I'll also pop it in the link below. I'm gonna enjoy <laughs> this. And I'll be back when I have something to eat later. So it's lunchtime and I'm pretty hungry now. So we have, so I have a latte um, made with my um, skimmed milk with a sweetener. So that's one of my healthy extra A's. Then I have one of these naked noodles, sweet chili. So that's one cent. And then I have bagel here, which is this uh, new york bakery one so that's my healthy extra b and i use just one light triangles you can have six of these i believe for your healthy extra a so i just used one of them um and then i've got a banana which is a free food and then this um reduced <laughs> in the co-op which is watermelon which is a speed food um really hungry now so i'm gonna go enjoy this so it's that time of day where I'm craving something sweet and I've also got all my jobs to do, cleaning in the house and things. So we're just going to have a quick hot chocolate, this is going to be a quick one. So two sins for my options hot chocolate. Right, this is tonight's tea. So we've got um, the Linda McCartney vegetarian sausages, the red onion ones which are free. We've got um, eggs and mushrooms, so we've got protein and speed food. We've got beans, which are a free, free food, and we've got um, tomatoes, which are a speed food, and bacon, which has gone very, very crispy, so I did it in the air fryer. Um, that's free and protein, because um, it hasn't got any fat on it. Now I'm gonna enjoy. I'm pretty hungry tonight, so I've just defrosted some blueberries, mango, and I've got fat-free yogurt, and I've got sin's worth of chop shop. So we've got the blueberries are speed, mango is free, yogurt is free, and we've got a sin for the chop shop. And then I've got two sins for my options, hot chocolate, bit gutted, because I had to scrape the last little bit out of the tub. 
but yeah so this is three sins so this should take me to uh, 15 sins so yeah we are right on the edge today i really wanted something sweet a chocolate bar tonight but hopefully because i've got the hot chocolate that should um keep me going for tonight um another great day on plan and uh, we'll just go through briefly some of the meals that we had so the pancakes were so delicious they looked great and they also tasted great so they were around about 10 cents in total which kind of seems a lot but then you don't have to use your healthy extra b so it doesn't so it's not too bad when you think of it like that because i could use that throughout the day then and i had that with my lunch um so yeah what i kind of because i knew i was going to have that in the morning i sort of uh navigated my day around that with sins so i kind of knew that i couldn't have many sins throughout the day so i had there's naked noodles at lunch which were really nice and i think i'm gonna buy a couple more of them in my shop because it's great because it you know when you've got time to make these healthy meals at lunch it's great if you can hear gurgling in the back and you might be able to see some feet going up and down as well i've got half in the background um so yeah so uh, it's great if you've got time to cook these lovely healthy meals but sometimes you just don't so having something like that in the cupboard is great because it keeps you one plan then so if I kind of look and think oh, I just don't have time to make anything instead of then grabbing a load of junk because I know I've not got time I can just make one of them quickly and it just saves me um from snacking and keeps me on plan so yeah do uh, so i think my next shop i think i'm gonna um buy a few of them to um keep me going throughout the week i've got a little guest joining me now because she was in the settle bless her yeah really difficult to try and film with little ones um so yes yeah, so like i mentioned in my last video which i will link below my last what i eat in a day I kind of had a rough start to the week so I knew that this week's weigh-in may be a gain but I kind of had those rough few days and then I drew a line under it and I thought let's just carry on I prepared what's gonna you know what I'm gonna see on the scales at the end of the week but we'll just continue um, eating well for the rest of the week so we have weighed in and I've maintained so really happy with that because I thought I was going to have a weight gain because I did really overindulge in those few days. Um, so I was happy with a maintain. We're on the Christmas countdown now. Um, so there's around about five weeks before the uh, week leading up to Christmas because I kind of know that week leading up to Christmas is going to be a little bit dodgy for me because there's going to be a lot of baking with the kids and all sorts and i'm not going to put too much pressure on myself over christmas so i'm not going to go mad but i'm not going to i'm going to enjoy myself so we've got the five week countdown so i'm aiming to lose another six pound within those five weeks because i think that's manageable um i'm not putting too much pressure on myself i think that's quite a reasonable amount um to kind of work with up until christmas so that would give me a total of um 10 pounds loss so far so if we can do that then obviously over christmas is probably going to be a little bit of a gain and then we can get back on it after christmas um so yeah that is my target so really excited to work towards that so before i go i wanted to show you these i picked up from b m so these are one and a half sins and they're the skinny whip minis so they're coconut and dark chocolate so i'll show you how big they are just for reference so um this is how big they are so these are one and a half sins so these are great for snacks but if you're anything like me put a couple on a plate don't have the whole bag with you because it could be dangerous but yeah they're great if like the other day i only had a few sins left i was like oh, i can't really have anything because i don't really have anything in the cupboard which are only a couple of sins um so i i think i only had three sins the other day left so i could have actually had two of these if i had these so i picked these up today and i've had a couple already so i need to put them away now so i don't keep snacking on them yeah so just to let you know that um these are in my local b&m at the minute and they are a nice little low sin treat so thank you for watching my video uh, if you haven't already i would love it if you could subscribe 
to my channel. I'm slowly seeing my numbers go up now, which is absolutely fantastic. I'm on around about 200 at the minute. And my aim is to get to 500 subscribers before Christmas. So if you could help me, I would really, really appreciate it. It would mean so much to me. Um, but I appreciate you watching anyway, even if you don't want to subscribe, but I would love it if you did. Uh, like the video if you enjoyed it and pop me a comment and say hi. I love hearing from you. I love responding to you. And I will see you in the next video. May have something new next week, um, but we'll see how we go. Um, see you in the next video. Take care, bye-bye.